Attorney Jonathan Elson, reminding you that if you've been injured in an auto accident, it's important to have somebody on your side. When you need a lawyer, then you need Nelson. You need Nelson. We've been a week and a half a day, so five and a half days. Bill and I, the undersheriff and I, sat down together, and the captains and I sat down together to some extent, and started making some um, observations and plans as far as a few policy alterations, new policy, changing different things. For the most part, it was baptism by fire. First day in, both both feet. It's very busy, very interesting, uh, very exciting. There's a lot of changes that we do want to make throughout the department and throughout the communities. Um, we have a lot of plans, and I think it's going to be all for the better. We are making a change to our uniform, which is going to be very noticeable in the near future. Um, it's going to be a minor change. We're just going to change the color of our pants. I am not spending the money on the department's budget to create a new badge, new patches for all our uniforms. And that, that has always seemed to been a tradition in the past. I don't see the need for that. Um, there are a lot of agencies throughout the country that have had the same badge for 150 years. There's no reason why we have to change our badge or our patches. Well, we're looking at manpower staffing all throughout the county. Um, do we need uh, as many people as we have currently in Beatty as opposed to maybe transferring one or two people from Beatty to Tonopah? Because maybe Beatty is a little bit heavy and Tonopah is a little bit light. We're looking at that all throughout the county. Um, it might even involve taking a few positions away from Pahrump and moving them to another another area of the county. So we're looking at all that. We're looking at uh, uh, administrative tasks, the tasks among all the administrators, who's doing what. We're looking at potentially shaking up the administration a little bit and moving them to a different assignment. Um, we've already implemented a little bit of that with uh, the upper administration and things are still being planned. Going very well, going very well. Uh, been here for one week. You know, it's a lot of familiar faces, some new ones. He and I retired. He retired from Metro. I retired from Knight County on the exact same day. Yes, and then he came back to Knight County, and I went on and did my retired thing for a while. So Until we agreed that he was running, I was going to be his undersheriff. We had never even met. So we spent several sessions feeling each other out and talking and, and making sure that we shared same belief systems and, and same visions for the sheriff's office, what we want to see the sheriff's office do, and here I am. The big thing is is the morale with the sheriff's office uh, and pretty much anything we can do at this point yeah. is rapport building, trying to make sure everybody understands we're all on the same team, you know. Everybody has different levels. He's the owner in this case, yeah. general manager managers, coaches, things like that, just like a baseball team or a football team, you know. Mm -hmm. Then you have the players. Everybody's important. Everybody's got their job to do. Yeah.